Hello, oh, welcome back to Spider's Web. It's another Real 2. It's Wednesday afternoon. And it's a Real to my dad. Let's get on with it, shall we? Probably going to have another Real 2 tomorrow as well because we're going to have some fun tomorrow afternoon. Um, we will be going to Wrightington. Uh, find my final show of my own. Oops. The final show of my own uh, is tomorrow afternoon. And uh, Ali's coming with me. Um, and uh, the Clallan Boatman, who was our, who I do the show with on the Saturday afternoon, he's coming in for the final show because he's um, taking over that slot on a Thursday afternoon um, after I've finished. So it's a nice way to hand over. Um, so well, we'll do another one just to have a bit of a chat about that. Um, could be interesting. Then again, who knows? We had an absolutely awesome afternoon on Monday. We were joined at Charlie Hospital Radio, as I was saying last week, by uh, Paul Finch. Um, the the show went really well. He had a lot to talk about. We obviously had the obligatory discussion about Doctor Who, um, because he wrote for a few things for Doctor Who and uh, me enjoying watching these TV series um, yeah it was quite uh, interested in hearing what he was saying um, he, uh, he did quite he did quite a good show I hope if anybody had taken the time to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? To uh, click on the link that I put in last week's Roll 2 video um, and actually listen to the show. I would, I'd like to know if anybody had, uh, did do um, because we had, as I said, a really nice show. Um, oh dear lord. We have. Oh, we did manage to get in last Saturday to do a show at Wrightington because uh, they're doing some work in the studio. A lot of the equipment's getting a bit used, shall we say, but worse for work. It's been basically non-stop used for five years and uh, been a little bit neglected, shall we say. So it needed a bit of a kick up the backside, shall we say. And uh, the equipment we used, I don't think was brand well. I know it wasn't brand new in the first place, so um, don't know really how. Um, oh, crying out loud! Don't know how. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Don't know how old it is exactly, but uh, it's not new, so it just may need a little tickle with the spanner. Were reprogramming, as they said on the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, reprogramming with a very large axe. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's uh, hopefully going to work out rather well. But that's it. I'm walking away from presenting shows at Wrightington. I'm concentrating my efforts at Charlie. Nowadays, um, Saturday afternoon is the only time I'll be going into uh, Wrightington now. I for reasons that I don't really want to talk about on here. Um, I, uh, I just feel like my efforts will be better served at Charlie. I'll keep it at that. <coughs> oh dear. I had a... I made an order. Um, oh, not last Friday, the Friday before. For some more pallet, uh, wet pallet papers. Unfortunately, they've gone missing in transit. Uh, I was expecting them last Tuesday, or Wednesday. I still haven't got them today, so um, I contacted to let them know they're basically going to give me a refund. And uh, I bought another pack. Um, what do we call it? I bought another pack from. Uh, another separate uh, thing on eBay so hopefully that will come on Friday well it's between uh, 
5th and the 8th, which is between Friday, uh, Friday to Monday. So hopefully it'll come on Friday. Um, <coughs> uh, I need some, basically. That's why I've not been, not managed to get any painting videos done, because I thought I had some over and I haven't. Um, and I'm one of these, uh, I don't think of what I'm doing while I'm, after I've um, finished painting. Um, I don't realise how long it's going to take me between paint jobs and by the time I get back to it the paint's finished. Not finished, not um, dried up because all the water's evaporated. So I have um, an issue with that. So I'm going to have to work on that one I think. As soon as I finish painting, um, <clears throat> as soon as I finish painting a mini, clean the uh, wet palette papers off and that way there's no issue. But, ah well. I haven't learned that yet, so I don't think it's... No, I have, I have learned it. I haven't put that into practice yet, and I've been using a wet palette for about three or four years now. So, hopefully, it'll actually sink in. <laughs> and I start actually doing all this, because um, it will last longer if I do that. <laughs> But there again saying that, I've run out and uh, Ali bought me this wet palette that I've been using now for the past year and a half. Uh, she bought me that for our first Christmas together. And uh, this will be our third Christmas together. So it, it's not as if, you know, um, what's the word I'm looking for? It's not as if it's, um, oh dear lord. Uh, <clears throat> what was I saying here? It's not as if it's uh, going out buying another pack every week. <laughs> you know, they do last if... Um, the problem is, I live on a... You know, I, I live on a ground floor flat. Okay, there's three... Oh, sorry, there's three floors of the block where I live. So, basically, there's two floors above me. Two, yeah, two flats above me. Um, and... You would think... That my flat would be quite cool because one her right, one her rises. No, on the contrary, my flat, even in winter, can be quite like an oven. So the so when we've had a, a really hot summer, it's been even hotter than usual, and the paint's drying quicker than usual because the water is evaporating quicker than usual. <laughs> So I've got through quite a few sheets over this last uh, <coughs> over this last summer in the hospital we've had, but like I said not to worry. Um, hopefully I get some. I think I've got enough to work with. I'm just trying to be a bit. I don't want to start something um, and I'll get get ready for setting up and start something and go to clean off the palette paper that I'm using and it rip, which I've had a few times, um, and then find that I've no palette paper. So I want to make sure that I've got some palette paper though, so that if that does happen, I can um, basically just get another sheet of palette paper out and carry on painting. the thin stuff that's the issue, it doesn't seem to last very long as well. Um, I've been used about two or three times and then it starts ripping when you try cleaning it off. But whether that's because it's permanently left on a pallet, I'm not sure. Uh, you know, in, in wet, on a wet pallet, where it's uh, evaporating and curling up. I mean, you've seen other videos sometimes where it's actually curled up while you've been watching the video. But, um, the oh dear lord, um, yeah, I don't know. Hopefully, somebody might be able to uh, tell me about it. I know I can use the baking sheets that are waxed, but. I really should invest in some of that, to be honest. I've got a nice 
um, wet pallets and I'm not using the, the proper sheets then I know I'm using the right stuff because I can quite happily go and buy something and get it on and then realise it's the wrong stuff and have to go back again and buy some more and then I can go back and buy the same near enough the same thing three times before I realise that look what you're reading or look at what you're supposed to read <laughs> Um, so, yeah, that's where I'm up to with uh, wet pallets. It's um, interesting. We have decided now that there is going to be probably two uh, Halloween evenings this week, or this year, um, for game nights. The simple reason being is that uh, Damien and Lee are coming around one night because Damien is off from work the Monday to Friday of that week so he's free then but Scragger he's away um, so well not away but he's away through work and he only gets back the day before Halloween and um, with him working during the week during the week it's, uh, if he comes he can't stay too long so looking at going home about 9 o'clock so we can get back home and get rested and get some sleep before work so understandable so what we're going to be doing is Damien and Leanne possibly somebody else don't know yet it all depends on uh, who we can find uh, Damien and Leanne will definitely be coming around on the Halloween itself and then Scrag will be coming around probably on the Saturday um, so we're going to get two two lots of uh, games nights done for Halloween Hopefully, we'll get some good games in, and hopefully, we'll get Wave 2 of Star Saga before then. Um, not that we're going to be getting into Star Saga, but, well, we might not be getting into the stuff from the Wave 2, um, because we've only really had a, an introductory game of Star Saga, we haven't actually played it properly. But I have been playing um, off and on the um, introductory games, you know, the learner games. Um, it seems straightforward enough. Um, so what we're going to be doing, hopefully, is with Scragger and Ali, and if we can get anybody else in, I don't know, we might get a game of Star Saga in on the second night of um, oh, the second night of the um, Halloween thing. Who knows? We'll find out. Um, I have to think of other things to play as well for Damien and Lee. I uh, don't want anything too long. So we get a few medium length games in. I'm trying to think of something that we haven't played on camera before. I have one that I know I definitely haven't played on camera. I don't think I've actually done a, a video for. Um, I may have done a couple of that, I don't know. Um, it's one I bought um, just before I went to Scotland. Um, <coughs> <clears throat> and it quite literally, as we were leaving on the Friday, that came on the Thursday. So I haven't had a chance to look at it properly before we went to Scotland. And when I got back, I opened it up, made sure everything was there. Um, but as I said, I don't know whether or not um, I've done a video for it. And that is Sheriff of Nottingham. <coughs> 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 Um, now that is probably going to be a game that we'll play um, on the Wednesday night. We may even play it on the uh, Saturday night as well. So you may end up with two lots of games of Sheriff of Nottingham for <laughs> for Halloween. Um, because as you know, I'm going to I'm going to uh, film everything we play or near enough everything we play. Some of the really shorter ones that you've seen time and time again, I probably won't play, but. Um, <coughs> You know, play something like Flux or something like that. I probably won't film that. Um, but uh, yeah, some of the, the bigger games I will always film and uh, let you see what we're doing. Um, but yeah, I would like <coughs> I'd like to get some Star Saga in with uh, Scragger. It would be nice. So I know he likes that kind of thing. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a fun little game. If I, if 
if we can get it done so that we, can, we might be able to play some on the um, on the Wednesday night and then play a different kind of game on the we might play the cooperative game on the Wednesday night <coughs> where there's no um, sorry, bad guy character um, it's all done with um, an artificial intelligent deck um, we might do that I don't know yet how it's possible as they say but uh, yeah, we might do we might do that on the Wednesday night, the cooperative version of Star Saga, and then play um, <coughs> the normal version of Star Saga on the uh, Saturday. Anything's possible, anything at all. But uh, we're now at my dad's, so I'm going to reverse into the drive. Try not to hit my dad's car. There's the beep to sound very close. I'm going to leave it there for another video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I know I seem to have uh, waffled on and on and on about nothing, but uh, that's all we do on these chat videos. <laughs> Until next time, which will probably be tomorrow afternoon when we're on the way to uh, Risington. Take care, God bless, and bye for now.